Feeling concerns over the fast spreading E. coli outbreak linked to quarter pounders sold at McDonald's. The New Mexico Department of Health is investigating five cases possibly linked to McDonald's in Bernalillo County, New Mexico. That includes Albuquerque and its surrounding areas. KTSM 9 News reporter Oriana Botaro has the details. They do have symptoms, um, which would be nausea, vomiting, stomach cramps, some fever, maybe, and diarrhea. When the diarrhea persists or when it becomes bloody, um, and the infection is worsening is when people should be really worried. At least 49 people in 10 states have been infected and one person has died in Colorado. While the contamination has sparked concern among consumers, the president of McDonald's insists that their focus is to keep customers safe. It is the, the quarter pounder and, and two ingredients on that quarter pounder uh, that are under investigation uh, by the CDC. So, you know, I, I want to say to our consumers that, that you can confidently go to McDonald's today. McDonald's has temporarily removed the quarter pounder from its menu in Colorado, Kansas, Utah, Wyoming, eight other states, including New Mexico. While it's uncertain how many locations in Texas have removed the item, I found out here in El Paso at least three McDonald's on the west side have followed suit. I wanted to know if you guys are currently serving the quarter pounder? No, I'm sorry. We won't be serving the quarter pounder. The president of McDonald's stresses that their food remains safe. Our founder famously said, if you take care of our, cu our customers, the business will take care of itself. And that was Oriana Botaro reporting. Dr. Chad Smelser says right now they are conducting interviews with those affected individuals trying to gather information on past foods they have ate. They're also conducting a health study with other states and the CDC to collect standardized information that helps to nail down exactly where it came from.